What's up guys, r and Horror Hunter, aka Steve, coming right back at you again. Yeah, I'm going to do a little video update here. Um, going to have some DVDs, some horror, some non-horror, not a whole bunch, just five titles, well six titles, and you know, one of them's a two-pack. Uh, yeah, Dan's Pawn Shop was having a nice uh, sale recently one dollar per dvd used dvds and these are in pretty dang good condition so i'm really happy so uh here we go starting off with the non-horror title yeah this is um spinal tap this is spinal tap special edition you know the case ain't in the best condition of course but it's not in bad condition at all and this is a great comedy movie yeah, I just loved it. Watched it last night. Thought it's a, thought it was a great thing right there. Love Spinal Tap. So, sorry, that's horror. Here's a non-horror, well, kind of. Alfred Hitchcock's Vertigo. See, I consider everything that Alfred Hitchcock does to be a little bit of horror. I know it's mostly suspense, but I consider some of it horror because it just has that feel and all the horror directors... They just seem to be, you know, very influenced by Mr. Hitchcock. But yeah, Vertigo, of course, it's a classic. You know, you can't really say anything bad about this, and then you can't really say anything more good about it that ain't already been said. So, there you go, Vertigo. Here's a two-pack. You saw that earlier. The Howling and the Omen remake. Yeah, The Howling, of course, classic werewolf movie. Uh, the Omen remake i don't know how it's gonna be it's probably not gonna be that good the original of course is a 100 percent beautiful classic but you know i don't know how the remake will be i'm pretty sure it's pretty crappy but you know i got it just for the howling so anyway eh, that's just another title i can add to my collection even if it is a piece of crap so yeah howling and the omen Next is Texas Chainsaw Massacre, the beginning. Uh, it's got this slip cover, and, um, you know, sorry about that, but, uh, you know, it's in some bad condition, but to tell the truth, I mean, the, the front of it feels really nice. It's a very creepy feeling, leathery kind of feel, embossed, um, yeah, very cool stuff. I mean, it does have this rip here, but to tell the truth, I mean, I don't really mind that rip because it kind of adds to the whole dirty, grimy feeling of the um, film. I have yet to actually see this. Uh, I haven't seen all the Texas Chainsaw Massacre sequels. I'm kind of like Andrew. Uh, this is Andrew Ballina's favorite uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre sequel. He says he loves it. So, you know... I'll probably like it pretty well, too. Me and Andrew have a lot of the same tastes with a lot of the stuff. But, yeah, I just picked this up uh, to add to my collection. I don't even have the original, but, you know, I may as well go ahead and start collecting as I see. So, yeah. Oh, and underneath, I'll show you the disc. Jiggle, jiggle. Just like that, you know. New Line Platinum Series. <laughs> but yeah. It's got some nice special features on here too. But, you know, it's supposed to be a pretty good movie. So, you know, I'll check it out. I said it's pretty brutal. And, finally, this is a almost... Yeah, this is a complete blind buy for me. It's a horror movie, but uh, it's a pretty much a blind buy. And if you guys have seen this, tell me about it. This is Bruce Campbell's Hatred of a Minute. Yeah, Bruce Campbell produced it. Uh, had a lot to do with the production of it and everything. Um, yeah, I mean, just don't know a whole lot about this movie. But I liked the cover and the name Bruce Campbell connected with me, even if he isn't in the movie. But I haven't seen this. So if you guys have seen it, um, you know, there's a spine. But uh, if you guys have seen it, Tell me something about it, guys, because I have no idea what this movie's about, really, except what I've read on the back. This does come with a crap ton of special features. Seems like a pretty good addition. I think it was direct-to-DVD. 
But yeah, Hatred of the Minute. Yeah. Don't know how it's going to be. So that's my update, guys. Real quick recap. Spinal Tap, great stuff. Vertigo, also great stuff. Howling, great stuff. The Omen remake, haven't seen it, but it's probably crap. Texas Chainsaw Massacre, the beginning. Supposed to be good. And Hatred of a Minute, the blind buy. So, uh, yeah, if you guys have seen Hatred of a Minute, please tell me something about it. Uh, tell me whether it's good or bad. If this edition is out of print or anything, I don't know. If you guys know that, also leave me some stuff. But yeah, once I watch this, I will uh, do a um, review on it. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Rock on. If you like, subscribe. See you later.